Bye. Math Story Introduction to Decimals The Decimal Planet The Decimal Planet is in danger. An asteroid hit our planet last night. The situation is extremely chaotic. The majority of our fractions and decimals are lost. We need your help. Oh no! Mr. Decimal and the Decimal Planet need my help. Who is Mr. Decimal? Your friend? Yes, Mr. Decimal lives peacefully on the Decimal Planet with his fellow decimals and fractions. He is head of the Decimal Planet. Even we live together on Earth. But what is so special about the Decimal Planet? On the Decimal Planet, every family consists of a fraction and its decimal. They are like the best siblings. They do not fight and share everything. Amazed by the description, Trihu and Sirhat cannot wait to reach the Decimal Planet. They swiftly board the spacecraft and leave. Uncle Matt and the kids have landed. Sirha is horrified by the visuals. Oh no, this is so sad. People are crying everywhere. How can we help them? Suddenly, a citizen cries for help. Help me, I cannot find my decimal brother. Help me, I cannot find my fraction sister. Listen to me carefully. To help the people here, all we have to do is help the fractions find their decimals and help the decimals find their fractions. But how? No fear when I'm here. Look at all the fractions around here. Do you find anything common? Oh yes. All their denominators are 10 or 100 or 1000. Exactly. Decimals are special types of fractions whose denominators are always 10 or power of 10 like 10, 100, 1000, etc. We represent such fractions as decimals like this. 0 0.1, 0 0.99, 8.888, 0 0.25, 0 0.0001. This dot between the digits is a decimal point. Oh, so do we add this decimal point based on the number of zeros in the denominator? You are right. This is read as 0 0.1. Similarly, this will be read as 0 0.25. We do not read the digits together after the decimal point. Suddenly, another citizen comes crying and says, I am 5 by 10. I cannot find my decimal sibling. 5 by 10 means I will write 0 5 first. Since the denominator has one zero, I will start adding a decimal point from the right after one digit. So, the decimal of 5 by 10 is nothing but 0 0.5. Look there. 0 0.5 is behind the tree. 5 by 10, that is your sibling. 5 by 10 is happy. Triho, come on, let us hurry now. We need to find all the decimals. Suddenly, the kids spot a camp. They decide to enter and find out. Oh no, so many decimals and fractions are here. Can you help Triho and Sirha in pairing decimal and fraction siblings? 25 by 100, your sibling is 0 0.25. Look, there he is. Similarly, they pair up 8 by 10 with 0 0.8, 15 by 10 with 1.5 and 1 by 100 with 0 0.01. Hurrah! They look so happy now. Help me too. Says a new voice. It is 0 0.08. Can you find its fraction sibling now? 0 0.08 has two digits after the decimal point. That means the denominator will have two zeros. So, 100 is the denominator and 8 is the numerator. The fraction is 8 by 100. Look there, she must be searching for you. 0 0.08 is elated. He finally found his sister. This continues and the kids need to find fraction sisters of 0 0.10, 5.3, 
35.40.10 and 10 by 100 are the siblings. 5.3 and 53 by 10 are the siblings. And finally, 35.4 and 354 by 10 are the siblings. Hooray! Seeing them finally united feels so good. Decimal Planet is peaceful again. This would have not been possible without your help. Says Mr. Decimal. Uncle Math and the kids are glad. It was a meaningful journey for everyone. A journey that not only helped them discover the relationship between fractions and decimals, but also identify the importance of loved ones. We learned that decimals are special types of fractions whose denominators are always 10 or power of 10, like 10, 100, 1000, etc. A decimal number consists of a decimal point. If required, you can convert fractions into decimals and decimals into fractions. Let's discuss who called Uncle Matt? Where were we going? What was special about the decimal planet? How did we help solve the chaos on the decimal planet? What is a decimal? What is the relationship between decimals and fractions? Follow us on Fun To Do Labs to enjoy watching more such math stories, songs and games.